Hey, thanks for watching. Uh, this video is about Family Guy and how they are completely, I, I don't want to say racist, but, uh, you know, maybe intolerant or discriminatory against Christians especially, and how I think that Seth MacFarlane is actually a closet Satanist, if not a blatant atheist, and, uh, maybe even part of the Illuminati. I'm going to show you some clips and some pictures and whatnot to kind of back that up. And uh, I want to get your feedback and see what you think. Um, first up is a clip I'm going to show you. Um, so I'll let you go ahead and see that. Now here you see the book in the background there, just there. They had the symbol of the eye on it. And also, you saw a book on the far left at the end of the counter that had a magnifying glass. Now pay attention to that magnifying glass because I'm going to come back to that. And there you see the same book sorry. again. I, I don't think you want this book. It's all about atheism. Oh, I know. I'm an atheist. Really? So am I. It's all yours. I feel bad taking the last copy. Well, there's one way to settle this. Okay, if there is a God, God, send another copy. Well, I guess that's our answer. <laughs> now, on this one, you see the all-seeing triangle again on the right-hand side and a picture of an angel on the left. And then on this picture, this is from the Illuminati episode and American Dad. And I know that's not Family Guy, but it's made by the same guy. Um... American Dad, I don't really have a problem with. I mean, they make the occasional God joke. I mean, it's funny sometimes, you know, but they don't always do it. And, you know, I, I just feel that Family Guy, they mock Christianity almost exclusively. I mean, they take a couple jabs at Muslims and Jews, but, I mean, there have been several episodes, full episodes, that just nothing but knocking at Christianity. Now, in this picture here, the Illuminati episode, you can see on um, the peanut guy, his monocle has the all-seeing triangle again. Um, and that's seen throughout that whole episode of American Dad. <clears throat> you you really clip, think that splashing magic Brian, water on Stewie will keep him out of hell? What's yeah, that kind of talk? You'll you, get your you, heathen you, head you smacked! No, that's very Christian. Believe what I say or I'll hurt you. Now nah, you're getting it! Hey, people got along just fine for thousands of years without AA. Just like they got along for thousands of years without religion. I like you and have no reason not to. I like you and have no reason not to. Hey, did you hear about that magic baby that was born in Bethlehem? Hmm. This one is probably there. the most... Usually the dude is disappeared by now, but it hasn't. He's just this sitting is the there like Joseph on his wedding night. Happiest night of my life, honey. Really memorable. Almost done in there, God? Shut up! And then here is showing a picture. It says, worse than Hitler because Brian's an atheist. So here he's saying, oh, us poor atheists. We're so persecuted. Everybody hates us. And yet you can see clear examples on how he is the one been persecuting Christians. Um, and I, I know that Christians, you know, some of them are overzealous or intolerant, and it's true. Some of them are. They take it way out of line. But in the Bible, it even talks about these kinds of Christians. Under Matthew seven <coughs> twenty-one, it says, Not everyone who says to me, Lord, Lord, will enter the kingdom of heaven, but only the one who does the will of my Father is in heaven. Many will say to me on that day, Lord, Lord, did we not prophesy, prophesy in your name? and in your name drive out demons, and in your name perform many miracles, then I will tell them plainly, I never knew you. Away from me, you evildoer. So, I mean, these people that are intolerant like that, and the Bible talks about them. I mean, there's a lot of people that proclaim to be Christians, and they don't follow the basic rules that Christ set down for us. But still, I mean, the, a true Christian is going to forgive people. They're going to pray for their enemies. They're going to turn the other cheek. Uh, and it seems like Seth MacFarlane atheist or satanist or whatever is just blatantly disrespectful of any faith that has to do with the geo-christian god um, muslim 
or uh, Judaism, but especially Christianity. So I just wanted to put that out there and get some of your guys' thoughts and what you think. So comment, like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Thanks.